Hi, I'm uh, Rob Morris and I'm here today to make you a lovely fish pie. I'm just going to go straight in with about a pint of milk. I'm going to flavour this milk a little bit. So I'm just going to go in with two ingredients. So bay leaf and some peppercorns, probably about five or six peppercorns. They go in there. And what I'm going to do, just bring that up to the simmer. You can use whatever fish you prefer. But for now, we're using responsibly sourced cod. That will go straight into the milk. And then we're going to bring it up to the boil. And then what we do is just take it off the heat. I've got another frying pan on the side here. So a little bit of olive oil goes in there. And then I'm just going to soften a leek. They'll just go straight into our frying pan here. And we're just going to leave those to cook for probably about five, six, seven minutes. Just keeping our eye on them. Add a little bit of salt and pepper. You can't rush beautiful food. That's the thing. You know, we're cooking things from scratch here. We're now ready for this next stage here. So the fish has been poached in the milk. It's just on the point of being cooked. Pour the milk into this pan. And obviously we want to keep that milk, you know, see that beautiful white fish there. Take our fish, pop it into your bowl. Pick out your peppercorns, very important, you know, because they can really take your fillings out if you eat those. So I'm going to make the sauce now. The basis for the sauce is that lovely flavoured milk. I've got about 25 grams of butter here, so we're making a basic roux, which is just butter and flour. So use a wooden spoon, just let that melt down. In this bowl here now, I've got some lovely mashed potato. This is mashed potato with a little bit of butter in. I'm just going to take my leeks and I'm going to tip them straight into the mashed potato. Give those a nice little mix in and then we're just going to leave those to one side. Right, so the butter's melted now. The plain flour goes into there. And what you need to do is just mix the two together so you get like a paste almost, okay? Just keep that on a low heat and we start feeding the milk into it. A little bit at a time. Don't put the whole thing in. Just put a little bit in. Give it a little bit of a stir, okay? It will start incorporating straight away. So keep adding that in, it'll, it'll you know, carry on incorporating. And what we're after is a beautiful glossy sauce. We need to taste our sauce. So with a spoon, and you just sort of taste it. And you can taste the fish, you know, you can taste the bay leaf, you can taste the peppercorn, but it does need a little bit of salt. Not too much, that's the thing. And then the other ingredient I want to add in here is some lovely fresh parsley. So we're just going to leave that simmering away for a moment. We've got the cod in there. Next thing, some baby prawns, okay? Straight from the packet, they go over the top, like so. Now take your boiled eggs and roughly chop them. All cooperative eggs are free range and you can really tell. And this is the old English part of, of a fish pie, is, is the hard boiled egg, you know? This is how they've been doing it for, for hundreds of years. So that just goes over the top there, like so. And this is the sauce. Look at that, beautiful white parsley sauce. Mashed potato. Take a spoon, using the back of the spoon, I'm just going to sort of push it into the corners a little bit. I've got some reduced fat cheddar cheese here, okay? Just scatter it over, you know, that's all. You don't want too much, you want to have that sort of cheesy, crunchy topping on it. That goes into a preheated oven, 190 degrees, gas mark 5, for about 25, 30 minutes, just so the top is all nice and golden, the cheese all bubbly, and to be honest, you'll just smell it's ready. And that's a classic British fish pie. Truly tasty, truly rewarding, comfort winter food of the gods.